Seth MacFarlane is arguably the most talented man alive worth $300 million, but for the thing that made him famous, he just stopped. And Seth MacFarlane's career started as an animator in the 1990s, working with the show Johnny Bravo alongside Butch Hartman, who created Fairly Odd Parents and Danny Phantom. And in 1997, he got the chance to make his own kids' show called Larry and Steve, which was actually very similar to Family Guy. And while the characters he created are clearly beta versions of Brian and Peter Griffin, he only managed to get a seven minute short, so he decided to pitch an adult show instead. And that pitch was Family Guy, where in 1998, Fox gave him a budget of only $50,000 to make the pilot. Just to put in perspective how small of a budget that was, at that time, The Simpsons cost $1.5 million an episode to make. But the show eventually got approved by Fox, even though it was cancelled after the second season in 2000, then cancelled again after the third season in 2002. It became more popular after being brought back in the mid-2000s, and then Seth MacFarlane signed a five-year contract making $100 million. But despite still being a voice actor on the show, he hasn't actually written for it in 13 years. And that's because he wanted to focus on Ted, which made $549 million on a bunch of $65 million. And that's a big reason Family Guy has kind of dropped in quality. With that, I'm Charles Brawl, subscribe to learn something.